Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today this video is about Microsoft's Moment 2 update, which is released to the main channel. And after updating, the build number will be 22621.1344. If you haven't received the Moment 2 update, just go to the Windows Update section, and check for the updates. Now, talking about the new features and improvements, the biggest flex for the KB5022913 update is that it includes a new search box in the taskbar that is powered by Bing. Bing is in turn powered by ChatGPT. This enables the users to get the most relevant results, directly from their taskbar. Moving forward, this update introduced a touch-optimized taskbar for two-in-one devices that you could use as a tablet. This feature only worked on devices that could be used as tablets and was on by default. To change that, go to Settings, Personalization, Taskbar, Taskbar Behaviors. The setting is called Optimized Taskbar for touch interactions when this device is used as a tablet. Also, you'll be having a drop-down menu for the touch keyboard. Next to that, this update also enhanced the system tray, formerly called the Notification Area. All icons had a rounded focus and hover treatment in the lower right, including the Show Hidden Icons Flyout menu. You could move icons to rearrange them in the Show Hidden Icons Flyout menu or move icons to the taskbar. This update also provides energy recommendations. If you use them, they could help to improve the energy efficiency of your PC and reduce your carbon footprint. You'll find it within Settings, System, Power, and Battery, Energy Recommendations. This update made enhancements to Task Manager. You can now filter processes using the binary name, PID, or Publisher name. The filter also applies when you switch between pages. The keyboard shortcut is Alt plus F. You can now choose a theme for Task Manager that is different from the Windows theme. Also, all dialogues, except for Run New Task in the Properties dialog, now support themes. The dialogues will use app-specific themes or the Windows theme. You can now opt out of confirmation dialogues when you turn on Efficiency Mode. And lastly, this update includes a redesigned Quick Assist app that lets you remotely help others or receive help with technical issues, even if your device is behind a firewall. So, that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog from the description. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.